What's up, everybody? Today we're back in Stuttgart, Arkansas, at my good friend Albert Shanahan's place. This time I brought a whole bunch of family with me, and we're going to try to get on some milk jugs at a thousand yards. Oh, got him right under the neck. Bottle ready. Hey. We started things off just by confirming zero at 400. There you go, man. Right above the other one. 420 yards. After this, both Uncle Rick and my dad tried to get on to the 840 yards with their respective hunting rifles, but the optics weren't quite up to the challenge. Oh, it's waving, man. And oh, right man. now, all you can see is about halfway up the target because, believe it or not, there's a hill. But that doesn't matter. Aim as if you were going on it because that round's dropping in. It's going to go over that hill. Over it and over there. Yeah. Oh, my ear muffled. No trace. Up next is my good buddy, Dan. We call him the sleeper. Right now he's shooting left-handed and wrong eye due to a shoulder injury, and he's still showing everybody up. That's an impact. Ooh, cool. That's another impact. I heard it. We're at about three second delay at this point. Wow, nice. <coughs> Nicely done, sir. Oh, nice spotting. Couldn't see it, Jake. Mm -hmm. Rick had an uncle that used to shoot motor loaders for 600 yards. And they were shooting small targets. Sure. Impact. 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 Second shot. Good job. Yeah, that's, a, that's one of those relatives that we Yeah. I'll pay a buck and a half so we pull the trigger. Impact. I can't even see the target at that distance, even with that optic, because it's it's literally behind the hill. So I'm literally aiming in the hill, in front of the target, knowing that my bullet's going over it to reach it, where that's set at. Well, at one point... Now it's time for my good friend Robert to get a chance to shoot long range for the first time. Nope. Couldn't see Did it. Did you see where it went? Try it again. First time you pulled the trigger. Heard it. I heard it. Yeah. yeah. There you That's go. I'm going to stop that. I'm going to stop right here. That's my boy. Good job. That that Fire in the hole. After Ricky had taken a few shots at 840 yards, he admitted that he was aiming closer to the head instead of into the hillside, which is probably why he wasn't making contact. To the best of my knowledge, this was the first time my father was able to reach out at an extended range with a bolt-action rifle. He did real well. Didn't hear it. No, no joy, no sound. That's an impact. Hey, heard it. Second shot. Second yeah, shot. No, second shot. Go again. <laughs> one more. Go? One more. <laughs> See if I can hit it one more time. 840 yeah, yards. It makes a difference when you can put your rectangle right on it. Oh, yeah, it makes a big difference. <laughs> All right, two in a row. Once I knew where it was. <laughs> Josh, you want to try it? I got two round, one round. Hang on, I'll give, I'll give you... One round, Josh. That's what you got to work with. <laughs> this is my son, and he's been training on rifles since he was big enough to hold one. Hey, 
Get it. First shot. First shot. You punk. <laughs> now watch. He's going to go three for three. Josh. Ah, that was a tink. I think you caught the edge of it. We'll give it to you. Third shot that I took. I went to look through the scope and then Mirage disappeared. That one was a no go. Hey, first two. We backed up to the thousand yard mark and moved the targets out. Dan's going first. Remember, he's got an injury to his right shoulder, which he normally shoots from. So he's shooting left handed, wrong eyed, and also shooting off a tripod at a thousand yards. And the wind is really boiling to the right right now. That's playing behind soybeans. Into the Bean shop, that's when you plant the post. No dirt. No dude, you, you're all around it. You are you're in there. You have to be. Based on the shots that we have seen and the corrections that you've made. And I know that right. So you're in there. You want to give it a chance to cool down and try it again in a minute? Yeah. Okay. My Uncle Ricky could not resist taking a few shots at a thousand yards with his 30 out 6 hunting rifle. Because of the optic that he was using, he was having to aim above the berm up in the skyline, which made what he was trying to do next impossible. However, the big 30 out 6 never disappoints, especially when you're firing it in between a bunch of grain bins. Now it's my turn to set the old Bagheera custom down and give it a chance at a thousand yards. Got it in the first magazine with cheap Hornady Black. First five rounds. <laughs> whoop, whoop. Who wants to give it a try? Robert? <laughs> I'll go for it. Yeah. It, left edge. Put the uh, center of the crosshairs, left edge. Same value. No. You see those three dots? Yes, sir. Hold on that third dot this time. Okay. Got it! Hey. It's loaded. It's loaded. Well, that took a long time to get <laughs> down there. Yeah, I mean, that was almost here. an extra second, it sounded like. Yeah. Ooh, I'm going to stop right there. you got to stop right there. <laughs> well, I'm ahead. I made a thousand awesome. yard shot. That's all I got. A thousand say. yard shot it has been done. My turn. Yeah. All right. Fire in the hole, people. Okay. I fucking find it again. There we go. Call for a wind call. Okay. Left edge. Left edge, no. Left edge, right now. Okay, we're gonna make another wind correction. Reload. Way off the right. Yeah, the, the heat mirage just laid flat. We're gonna go four dots to the uh, on the on the reticle, count four dots to the right. That's your new hole. How? Where? Looking on the reticle. Yeah. 
Find the center. Yeah. Count four dots from to, from the center right. Count right four dots. Yeah. That that's your hole. That dot is what you want to put on the target center. Okay, reload. I think you may have had just the tiniest little flinch. Do that again. There it is. Hey, there it is. Third shot. Good shot. Whoop, whoop. You got one more round. You want to try again? Might as well. See if we can get two in a row. What's wind doing? I'm watching. Go ahead and get comfortable. Hold for one call. Four tenths to the right. Far in the hole. There it yeah. is. Oh, got it. You love it when math works. <laughs> you I get do, repeatable do. results making it happen. Spotter's on. Let me give you one on the wind call. Hole three. All right, do it again, hold four. There it is. There it was. He missed like that much. The first one. Yeah, went right on that left shoulder. Publicity to help us sell this rifle and raffle it off. We're going to try to hit a milk jug at a thousand yards, and uh, hopefully we get some favor here. Got the left one. Yep. That's the one I was going for. That's what I'd say too. Well, I wouldn't say if it wasn't the truth, Albert. <laughs> Just to prove it, I'm going to go for the other one now. <laughs> It's emptying. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's yeah, been hit. All right, cool. Got them both. Two confirmed kills. All right. too shabby looks like the majority of them were coming in just a little bit low but uh what we did on the milk jugs look at that i hit that sucker twice on this side there and there and and that one hit just a little bit on the low side right there and empty that's why it emptied out yeah, heck yeah. I take that all day. Good job. Thank you, brother. Well, that's going to do it for us on this trip. Y'all join us again next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe. God bless.